Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. The next topic of our discussion is Wolf PSAR. Wolf PSAR tool is basically used to uh, predict the protein's subcellular locality. That uh, after the synthesis of the protein in the cytoplasm, uh, where does it localizes within the cell? Either it goes to the mitochondria or endoplasmic reticulum or nucleus or lysosome or where the protein is going after its synthesis. So we can predict this through the protein primary uh, amino acid sequence. So this one is <coughs> the home page of the Wolf PSAR. The only thing we need to set are certain very simple uh, parameters. For example, if, if we, are, we are using uh, the human protein, then we have to select this option, animal. And secondly, uh, we have two. Uh, we have two mode of importing the sequence. The first one is either we need to paste the sequence here in this query box, as a uh, in the in the faster format, or we we need uh, to paste the sequence uh, to save the sequence in the file, and uh, we will import the file from this choose uh, file button. So, for example, we are using this area for the protein to be uh, imported inside this box. So. <coughs> For example, this one is the protein. Copy the sequence. Make a faster format. For example, insert two. Go to the next line and paste the sequence, and just submit the button. Submit. ये ये result page है जो prediction perform हो गई है. So it shows that with the highest probability, it is predicted that NSN2 could be localized inside the nucleus with the highest probability value of 25.5. In the descending order, it is predicted that it may also be localized inside the <coughs> cytoplasm with the probability value 15.5 in the mitochondria with the probability of 1 and in the cytoskeleton with the probability of 1. So least probability is that cytoskeleton and highest probability is that NSN2 protein will be localized inside the nucleus. So it's a general uh, prediction tool which could predict uh, the, lo the localization of any protein inside the different uh, localities. Or on the other way there are some other tools as well who could only predict uh, the localization signal of a particular subcellular organelles. For example, NLS Mapper a uh, software hai jo sirf uh, nucleus ke andar predictions uh, perform karta hai ke whether the protein could be localized in the nucleus or not. Yani yes or no me uska answer aata hai. Kyunki uska kaam sirf a specialized uh, subcellular organelles ke andar prediction ko perform karna hai.